And after all that waiting and all that effort, here's the reward. Together, you and your partner have created the ultimate miracle. You've brought a new life into the world. Miracle of birth. Are there any questions? Mm -hmm. um, not so much a question, really more of a comment. Yes. Uh, no offense intended, but this video is very misleading. Don't, don't mind my partner. He was suckled by wolves. He doesn't really play well with others. <laughs> <laughs> well, not wolves. Close. <laughs> um, no, but actually, as, as the only member of the class that, that has experienced this firsthand uh, on more than one occasion. And, and I, I'm sure they would love to hear your, your war stories, but maybe some other time. I, I'm not criticizing the video. I'm really not. I'm, I thought it was relatively well done. Um, but the part where they're talking about what you're going to feel when you're in the delivery room. Oh, no, no, no. When you're actually experiencing don't the process of it. do this again. They don't want to hear how, you know, things can go wrong and how long labor can be and, and how natural is really best when you're screaming for an epidural. <laughs> I wasn't going to say any of this. Yeah, stuff. well, then you were going to talk about how overly sentimental the video was. No. All I was going to say is that the reality of being in the delivery room and seeing your child come into the world is a thousand times more miraculous and more magical than any video can ever depict. especially if you're lucky enough to be sharing it with someone that you love. Mm. Oh. <laughs> so I uh, invite you in here to be my birthing coach. And what do you do? You take over. And you hated it. Did I say that? You didn't hate it? No, I didn't. I, I actually learned something. I'm glad you're going to be my coach, okay? You obviously know what you're doing, and uh, that means that I can count on you, and hopefully I can relax a little bit when I get into the delivery room. Good. Because you're going to do great. And I will be with you every step of the way. Okay, I'll try not to take that personally. No, personal. No, it's not personal. It's not. I just have my nap time, which is like clockwork, and I should get back to the beacon. Yeah, sure. Oh, Miss Spencer Spalding needs her beauty sleep. I can take you. Tuck you both in if you like. Um, no, it's okay. I'll see you. <laughs> 